The only time I actually turn my phone on sound is like sometimes when I watch porn, like on Twitter or something, because sometimes you have to flip the switch too. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't know how to feel about yeah. it. I wasn't sure how to feel. You don't want to give him too much truth. As soon as he said porn to Twitter, I was like, he about to out me. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Wording is Hard. I have my very good friend, Takara Williams. She is hey. comedian, teacher, mother, writer, producer extraordinaire. And today she's my classmate. Yep. Huh? Yes. How you been? I'm good. How are you? I'm fantastic. I'm excited about this here because... Yeah, me too. Because you're a teacher. Now you're on the other side of it. I am, and I'm out of a fail. <laughs> Takara and I used to work together yeah. at a jail. We mm-hmm. worked at a jail out here in uh, L.A. County. A jail. Uh, yeah. And I don't know. You guys can't see it right now because she's sitting down. But you can kind of tell from how she's sitting. Takara thick. And she used to. <laughs> <laughs> when she first started working at the jail, because I was there first. And then I, a lot of comics came after me. When Takara first started working at the jail, all the all the inmates was like, yo, who's the new teacher? <laughs> I was like, you know you can get thrown in the hole for that, right? I don't care. <laughs> I'll go to the hole for her. I don't even care. You know what the funniest part is when I see them when they out? Ah. They run into me and be like, yo, yo. Yo. You know, Remember me? I'm like, oh. I'm like, I do, and all the felonies that are coming with you. Absolutely, I do. <laughs> you got a haircut. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Like it's, you shower it's, today. It's they like, act look, different when look. they don't get told when to go to bed. Yeah, you look different. You look, yeah. uh, you know. All right, so basically we have five words on these index cards. Very difficult words. I don't know them. You won't know yours until you look at them. Uh, and we will pronounce these words to the best of our ability. And Maya is back here to keep us on track. She's hey, a teacher, so she's going to let us know if we are incredibly right or incredibly wrong. <laughs> I am usually always not right. Uh, and then after that, we have uh, another round, okay. which uh, I will explain when we get there. Okay. So right. I'll kick it out first. You know what I'm saying? Kick you my off. guest. Go, go you know what I'm saying? So I'll go ahead it. and uh, <clears throat> get it going. All first right. word is my name. Uh, and I think we know that one. <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, what? I'm I'm just gonna say, <laughs> mawkish. Ma- yeah, mawkish. 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 Yes. Mawkish. All right. Um, I think mawkish is actually a name of a son of the most southernest black mama Jesus. with the lisp. Oh, and um, she did not actually finish school, so she <laughs> pronounces it mawkish. Marcus, come on in here and oh get goodness. them beans off, off of the stove. Marcus, mom, my name is Marcus. I named you Marcus, and yes. that's okay. That's what it is. So it's son mm-hmm. of a mother who did not finish school. <clears throat> okay. In the south. In the south. That's not. That's just a guess. That's, that's not. not final. That's not my final. Okay. People who don't like romantic comedies. Call them mawkish and sappy. Oh, um, okay. Well, yeah, that's that's different. Mawkish, uh, mawkish and sappy. People who don't like romantic comedies call still them mawkish and sappy. So mawkish could be boring or something that doesn't incite excitement. So boring or Whack. No. No, I wanted to give it to you too. I wanted you to give it to me too. It wasn't close, so I can't. Damn. Damn. What kind of teacher is this? It's a, the realest, I guess. <laughs> she don't look like it, but you, she was in them streets. You wasn't even close. You, I wanted you to win, but you suck at everything, <laughs> including <laughs> life and pronouncing the definitions. But I wanted you. To. So what is mockish? Excessively sentimental. Oh, man. Isn't that what sappy is? Yes, that's yeah, why you that's should why get it. it. Yeah. All right. Usually when it's like something and sappy, it's the, two the first things. of, yeah. It's, mm. Okay. It's my go? Yes. Okay. My first word is going to be what? Um, you dirty motherfuckers. Uh, okay. Uh, oh. <laughs> I, keep, keep, no. I don't even know what to it's do at this point. Just, just, I'm trying to figure this out. This is just nothing but syllables. Uh, <laughs> Nothing but uh, consonants. 
Continent, you know, you know what I mean. Consonants, vowels, vowels, syllables. Uh, if I can't say that, you know, I can't read the word. I don't even know. Um, <laughs> oh, you read it. You 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 identify the letters, but you just don't know <laughs> what the fuck they mean. Oh God. Um, so I think my word is gonna be. I'm thinking it says um, Evans, Evans, Evans. Which one is it? Evans, Evans. or Evans? Say is it French? Say. No, no, uh, pick one. <laughs> pick one so she can, she can make Even one. say. No, no. Even say. Um, I'm going to go. <laughs> I'm going to go with. Yeah. Uh, That's not it. Rara's not it. Evans? Evans? Yes, Evans. 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 Yes. First of all, um, I, if I had to uh, yeah, give a definition, I would not know. I'm going to just take this on the back. Uh, you, know, you, will, you don't even want to try? Nope. The word took that much out of you. Yes. <laughs> my heart. Uh, the purpose of art is to evince the ideas of the artist. So I'm thinking evince means to, um, the purpose of purpose of art is to evince the ideas of the artist. To imagine the ideas of the artist. To put yourself in the same position. Mm. To, uh, no? Mm. No. 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 Well, no. then that's what I got. This, I'm surprised I pronounced it right. <laughs> to show or demonstrate clearly. <laughs> okay. I right, teacher. Do you, you act, do you know this one? You acted like the students at the jail. <laughs> you acted just like don't be mad because you wrong. Look at that. Did I mock Did I mock her? Yeah. <laughs> you had, <laughs> she act <laughs> look, look to here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm gonna go with my next word. <laughs> you mean you're gonna next word? <laughs> Petty ass Patty over here. Pap. T T Y. I know what that means. Oh, okay. <sighs> just quit. I'm gonna just have a sign on this one now. <laughs> Wait, did you use it? You gotta use your finger like this. I don't know. I'm just gonna. I'm just saying. I feel like some, you ever like say something fast and just hope it's right, but people didn't hear you, so All they just the accept time. it. <clears throat> <clears throat> this word. That is a real word. Is uh. Legitimate. Okay. Like right. like Heath Ledger Demon. Ledger Demon. Good. Ha! Ledger Demon, if I had to guess, guess. Uh Gase. Shut up. Okay. Don't need that from you. Alright. Okay. Yep. The magician's skill of Ledger Demon gave him a successful show in Vegas. Okay, so. Based on this, he <laughs> <You> got it. <laughs> Based on this, nothing. Legitimate means, um, shit. I'm, I don't know, man. I'm gonna like, go with I feel I'm like gonna, you're going in the right direction. Yeah, I feel like it's misdirection or what, what do they call magic? Magic is. It's not, I can't think of the word that they call magic. It's not magic, it's, uh, and it's not sleight of hand. But misdirection is kind of where I'm, I'm landing. I'm landing in the vicinity of misdirection. That's very close. You had it on the nose with sleight of hand. Well, I said sleight of hand, too, so I'm going to go ahead and take that. <laughs> she got to give it to you. Oh, Wait a second. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going right. to give it to you. Johnny. Trust okay. me, she never does this. Okay, okay my she next never, word. never helps me at all. Okay. It's not Takara, so I just want you to. Because I don't know that one anyway. <laughs> uh, my next it's word made is. Up. Oh, she ain't never going to get that shit. Who did this? <laughs> <laughs> well, I learned in one of these episodes that all words are British, so blame the British. This ain't real. This ain't even a real word. Well, somebody is, wrote it down. This is not animal. Um, I tell you this, this won't be a word that you see on Wheel of Fortune. They ain't got enough spaces for that. It's not. This is a word you're going to see. On your ACT prep? Right here. Or a SAT? Uh, That's an honest English word right there. It's a, it's a grade word. What? All right, so I'm going to go with uh, Enemico. And and make all. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Can you repeat your answer? Uh, before you say it, 
Think about what you just said and think if that sounded like a goddamn word. None of these sound like goddamn <laughs> words. That's the point of this game. Okay, all right, we'll go. Go right uh, ahead and say that shit again. It's not animal. 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 I nipple. I nipple. I nipple. I nipple? <laughs> did you just add a P? I did. Okay. It's that YouTube porn. Let's get me in there. Uh, oh, God. Um, so it's. Inimical? Yes, that one is correct. Oh, uh, okay. you walked your dance and dirty you, job you, you all did, over that word. You did this with yours. A, B, plus the one, <laughs> C, dash two. You did that with yours. I can't do that with mine. You okay. sounded that shit. You were 100% wrong when you first Twice. said it. Um, inimical, I think it means it's a medical term. Uh, no, it's not. Okay, inimical. Uh, I don't mean, get shook by my look, because I don't know. I don't know what this means. I'm going to flip it over. Mm. Three more sentences. It says, the biggest fear of first contact is that the aliens will be animal. Oh. Um, I that, said, you got that. Animal. Would that be like, uh, the biggest fear of first contact? Or the, would that be like um, confrontational or uh, aggressive or... Um, just not nice. Like they would be. Like they would want to. They want to blow us up. Uh, I want to blow us up. Um, <laughs> that the aliens would be. Uh, yeah. Like they just wouldn't be approachable, or they would be. You know, confrontational or aggressive. Or, yes, hostile. Yeah, hostile. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. You got that. You know what be so crazy is that we be knowing the words like hostile. Sweet was... little did did <laughs> You are not Donnell Jones all over my. My comment. I did. Okay, go ahead. What was you going to say? I, I knew hostile, but couldn't think of the word hostile. I like, couldn't think of the word when hostile. You're, when you're on the hot seat, you were like, ah, ah, ah. Yeah, I'm, ah, like, I'm like unapproachable, ah, 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 argumentative. Uh, and aggressive. I was thinking of like, uh, and then she said hostile, sleight of like, hand. I was like, what is you the did word? Say sleight of hand. I did, but I was like, magicians, that, that ma magic isn't called magic, it's called. Illusions. I illusions. couldn't fucking think of illusions. My brain was like, it's our illusions, and it closed the, the fucking you draw. Know what you, you I was know, like, I don't you know, know what, your what brain you said? Hey, illusions, come over here for a second. Let's get over here. Let's see what's moving over here. Sit over here. I don't like how many of these words make me stop breathing. I like that. You have a approach a word, word, and it just be like, what the fuck is that? I know that, that word. I know that word. Only word I know. <laughs> well, I'm glad I got it and you didn't. You know what? <clears throat> All right, this word right here, implacable. Yes. Ha! I knew that. So, um, implacable is when someone wants to give you, like, a plaque for, like, employee of the month, but you are homeless. So they have to give you a medal, a medal instead, or a trophy because you're implacable. Because you ain't got nowhere to put them. I don't want to laugh because I believe them. You got perfect attendance, and we would like to award you with this plaque for perfect you don't have attendance. A wall to put it yeah, on. I ain't really got a wall right implacable now. Implacable ass. Oh, uh, okay. Well, let's switch it to a medal because he's implacable. So that's basically <laughs> what that is right there. Give him a certificate. Yeah, yeah. So let me see. See how right I am with that. <clears throat> there was nothing James could do to please his implacable ex-wife. Okay, so there was nothing James could do to please his implacable ex-wife. I'm going to guess that means um, difficult? Yes, that is close enough. Unable to be pleased. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> clink, clink. <laughs> okay. okay. Queen Latif used to do that on uh, Live a Single. Yeah, clink, clink. Okay. Like, clink, clink. <laughs> you <cute>. see me. <laughs> uh, my next word is. Oh, I actually know it. Know that one. Um, it's. You want me to help you sign it out? No. Okay. Uh, exculpate. 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 Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Yes. Okay. Exculpate. I'll go ahead um, and say that. Sentence says, 
Uh, the police arrested him for kidnapping, but he had an alibi to exculpate himself, which is to like maybe exonerate or to. She already know that because uh, she's a jail teacher. <laughs> it's and true. You, it is. A, you know what? Was exonerated. As soon as she said exculpate herself, I was like exonerate. I did the same thing because <laughs> that's the, jail. the one time the word stayed in, yeah. our, in our in our in our brain. It actually wasn't for jail for me. It was actually from Law and Order for me. Oh. Yeah. He's, he's been exonerated. I can't tell you Damn where it. I heard mine because it was a, it was a stupid scenario and I it just stuck with me. Oh, you've been exonerated. Uh, yeah, no, not me. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 not not me. Not this year. <laughs> um, the, okay, so it just means to exonerate, to excuse, to uh, have, have reason. Um, to yeah, that's, that's correct. Thank you. <laughs> Let me do the uh, clink clink. Let me clink you. Find your own victory noise to do. Pow, pow. <laughs> Exonerate, you get it? Pow, nothing? Okay. Uh, well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. This card fills up a word fills up the whole damn card. Do you see this? This is his show. You would think that I would get it easy, right? You think that they would go easy on me? I wouldn't. They don't. Wouldn't. N- none of the episodes okay. have they given me words just like Oh, I know the, that word. Do you? Yeah. I keep trying to get past the EC and I, my, all my mouth will say is, if you can hear me on the mic, I'm literally, because that L is like, stop, nigga, where you going? You got to acknowledge me. And I'm Thank just like, you. I'm right here. That L like this. It is so strong. It's it is so funny like because this. if you look how the person wrote it, it's the only thing capitalizing right. it. So you know you can't ignore that L. But you got the swa over the E, and it's like that little accent, you don't know, like, does it make the A sound, right? If you do that one more time. I am really trying, but that L just does not fit with the ek. Well, take the ek out for a second, pronounce it after the L. Don't do that to me. And then don't go talk back to me and like add that. the E. You don't have to talk to me like that, I'm sorry. okay? Still I'm trying my goddamn best. If you bad. do it right now, it was patronizing. My That's bad. a word for that. All right. The definition. Okay. assessment. No, not at all. I wasn't. No, I was sounding it out just loudly. That was his. Are you that buying was that? His. No. Okay. I don't buy that either. Okay. Ecle assessment. Eclaircissement. What? Think of an eclair, like a pastry. Yeah. Sismont. Is it French? Yeah, it has the accent. I didn't think the whole thing was French. It clears Why would a piece of Why would a piece of a word be French and not all of it? French is French, but you don't say French. Do you? Do you go around saying French? No. So the piece But of, can I get my French on fries? Yeah, yeah, you don't do that. So it's French on fries. You know what? English is derived from French. See, you see why I did it? You see yeah. why I did it the first time? It's very, it's very fitting. She like this, like this English. And it's very fitting at times because I just wanted to right there. Okay. Um, <laughs> Eclassement Mont is. Wait, say it again. Say it again. No, I'm not going to say it again. Eclassement This word means. <laughs> Donut. Yeah, it's uh, it's if you're if you're a if you're an eclair baker, I'm leaving. Wait, let me finish. <laughs> Where's my pencil? This is the study of baking eclairs. This is what I'm gonna go with. That's my final. No, that's not my final. So I, I almost said that, but it's not. He sat under a tree waiting for. Clarismore. Clarismore. Clarity. It's the French yes. word for clarity. Yes. Good. To mm. clarify something. To make clear. Clark <laughs> Clark. Clear is in the word. I told him to break the word down, but he told me don't tell him what to do. I mean, clear is in the word in French, but I told him that's what. clear in that word. That's Claire. That's somebody. I know a couple of Claire's. That's her name. That's, that's a not lady Claire. who wear the pantyhose that go in the thing. Her name Claire. No, that's Gertrude. My next word is... Okay. 
What is this? Uh, circumcised. Uh, I, I've read that. Nope. Wait. I literally Circumbulate. just read that somewhere. Circumbulate. Circum. Hurry up. We gotta go. Um, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Give a lot of your private life up right now. Woo! Um, hurry it up. 60 minutes. Um, circumvalate. Valate. Valate. Mm. Circumvalate. Mm. So comes very late. Circumvalate. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to go with yes. circumvalate. Yes. Yeah. I think circumvalate um, was. Don't you just go with what you were figuring? Yeah, <laughs> when a woman is like, sir, can you come? We're going to be late. and Or he comes very late. Or. So you, I, think it, I think it is, derives from the word circumcised because it says circum. But that could also be uh, circumference. Cir, 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 or circuit. No, circuit, circum. No, there's no. Circum ballet. Hmm? Circum, get your ballet. Uh, uh, Can I be honest with you real quick? Can I just say something real quick? Just really quick? <laughs> yes. This is, with no tone or anything. Mm-hmm. It's really fucking dumb. Yeah, it is. It's okay. Really it's okay. Dumb. It's okay. That's what I got. Definition. That's what okay. I got. That's what I got. That's, that's, what not, got? that's not my real definition. Okay. 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 Well, flip it over and see if you can figure out if the uh, serve comes really late. Serve comes really late. Um, <clears throat> okay. It says, she asked the builders to circumvallate her home with a stone wall to surround. Um, I'm thinking it means to surround, uh, like build a perimeter or to cover, um, to cast out. Cause I don't see why you want a cast stone, out. a stone wall. I mean, you don't want nobody in there. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Uh, she ain't got a fence, a little fence you can see through the hole. She don't want you to see nothing cause she is telling her sir to come. Um, so, so what's so wait, wh- which is it? Is so it? she asked the builders to circumvallate her home with a stone wall. I think that means to cover, to protect, to build, to uh, circumvallate, to circumvallate her home with a stone wall. Uh, just to surround. Yes, yes. surround with You almost wall. talked yourself out of that. Don't tell me what to You do. almost, when you said cast out, I was like, oh, this dumb motherfucker right here. Circle and surround. That Don't tell been. me what to do. Don't tell me what to do. All right. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what? No. 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 I reject it. I want a new word. Can we do that? No. No, you cannot. <laughs> Making up rules as it goes along. You got this. No, I do not. You do. You know I don't. I don't, but I was trying to be supportive. Thaumaturge. Wow, you did get that. What the? I'm out here, bruh. Y'all be thinking I'll be out here playing. I'll be reading Word of Day calendars. I'm out here, bruh. In real life. Thaumaturge. That's (laughs) not what you said the first time. I didn't get it right I was telling you I stuck. I got a gap. So I'm telling you guys that. All right. Um, so this means uh, I have no idea. I can't even make up something ridiculous for. I just gotta flip it over just and try flip, to figure. Yeah, yeah it's, that was a lot. The commentary in movies is often depicted with a long white beard. The villain. So I'm thinking, I mean, villainous or bad. What movies is there a villain with a long white beard? America. (laughs) I'm not going to give that to you. Although you pronounced it correctly, it's a performer of miracles or magic feats. I was thinking Lord of the Rings, the guy with the long beard. That's what I thought of when you read that. I... I'd... Michael, um, are you done? So I'm done. My next word, my word is what? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Y'all I was it. playing, you boy. We meant to get different. We should have switched. Uh, is it contemporaneous? Yes. Oh yes. man. Contemporaneous. Um. That's a mouth sore. 
Does it, is it like, I, I, I think this word means to be held in some sort of contempt um, all the time. You are an avid contemporaneous. Uh, it says John Brown and Karl Marx were contemporaneous figures. Ha! That did nothing. You understand me? That helped zero. <laughs> Clink, clink. If, if I knew who they were, it would help me just a little bit. I wish it would have said James Brown, but it didn't. Uh, <laughs> it didn't help at all. What John I Brown, shut it. John Brown and Karl Marx were contemporaneous figures. Why would you do that? That shit might as well have said yabba dabba do. <laughs> it did <laughs> fucking nothing. And I love it. <laughs> I'm glad you said I love it. Um... John Brown and Karl Marx were a contemporary. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> uh, um, I'm going to go with what the fuck. Um, let me take my glasses. Maybe I read it different if I take my glasses. That ain't going to make no damn difference at all. Is that um, it? okay, Shush, let me see if John Brown, went, you know, if it's... Is, is his spirit going to come and yeah, talk to you and just, tell you what just, the meaning it is? It may happen. Who is John Brown? Like, we should be able to ask questions. Like, can I get a lifeline? Like, can I call mm -hmm. somebody? Mm -hmm. John Brown, I go... Do you really face. not know who John Brown is? I don't. See, you got your glasses down in front of your face again. <laughs> you know, you can tell by the tone that the glasses is riding that nose like a sound. Are they like, um, uh... Like, not successful, but just like, um, what is the word? Uh, God is gone. Um, okay. No. I'm gonna fail you for not knowing who John Brown okay. is if you do not give me the answer. Okay. <laughs> uh, who he was or the answer to the. No, who John Brown was. I don't know. I don't remember. We I went to school a long time ago. Everything has changed. Math has changed since we went to school. I don't even know this kind of math. Okay. Wait, can I, My son is John 19, ma'am. I don't know. Musician, right? No. Wait, what? Abolitionist. Oh, that John Brown. John Brown. He said, oh, that. He didn't know what it was. Because <laughs> Carl Max is a jazz player, so I just assumed that John Brown was, too. So uh, what is it, music? Karl Marx invented oh, communism. I'm going to shut the fuck up. So John Brown and Carl what are they like? Life changing or like I don't know. It's just I don't. they lived at the same time. Okay. Contemporary. Oh, I mean, okay. So the, they lived. They lived at the same time. Figures. Yeah. That don't make. Well, Contemporaneous. They so, were each other's contemporaries. Oh, we lived. We were contemporaneous. We lived in two thousand and nine. Like this. It did. Y'all didn't help me. I feel like y'all should. I feel like y'all should be disqualified. <laughs> Now we have one sentence I want in that life. we have to read. I want in life. It's a, it's a strongly worded sentence, oh and we have 10 seconds to read it correctly oh with as little errors as possible. Oh, okay? God, yes. It's the same sentence? No. Okay, two separate sentences. Two separate sentences. You first. All right. In a minute, say go. Hmm? No, I, I, you don't count me down. In a minute, say go. Here we go. Clink, Three. Clink, clink. Two. Right. One, go. In the image, there is a diamond shape, which potentially could be a Scottish gun emplacement. Yes and yes. Mine is going to say impenation and monachalus. You're going to have you words ready? that all sound like monochromatic. You ready? Your first word is supercalifragilistic. No, no. I just want to make sure I was flipping it the right way. I was okay. looking for the red line. Okay. Okay, go. Mm -hmm. It showed a colonic interception. What of the transverse colon with a large mass acting as a lead point? I'll give you partial credit for going under time, but you left out at least one syllable. I left out seven. <laughs> long as you know. Long as you know where well, you fucked you. up, because you. you fucked up. What is the teacher's name? Maya. 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 Mm -hmm. Teacher Maya. Okay, thank you, teacher Maya. Miss Maya. Maya. Okay. How you feel about that? What what? What just transpired? How you think you did? I think I did. I think we did. I think we did good. 
I think we did great. I think that this is challenging us at our age, and it's when you don't go to school for a while, this shit it uh, it goes away. It does. It's yeah. like reading aloud. Like you, you yeah. don't do that in a while. You just be like, I'm not reading the day at church. Right. If he call on me, I'm gonna say, fuck you, pastor. <laughs> But God, I love you. <laughs> yeah, that ain't for you, Jesus. But he know I ain't. He know I ain't yeah. been here seventeen years. Yeah, um, you want me to I read think, all I these? And that's two pages of his announcements. I think we did good. Send out the email. Why do I gotta do these announcements? And we got everybody's email at the church. Right. Let's just email it to the little read it to the self. All right, Maya. Let us know who uh who's taking on the goal today. For the first time ever, <laughs> to hear has won. Clink clink. <laughs> What was the score? 90 to 80. Okay. Oh, you still did good, friend. Yeah. Like you know that. what? The important thing to remember and take away from this type of thing is, like I said, we don't do it often. Click, click. That's what you want to take away from it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it was by one. No, it was. Wait, was it? It was it, 80 she, by 91, right? No, 80 by 90. It goes in tens. Yeah. You won by one. Wait, it's 8 by 9 or 80 by 90? I mean, either one, it's the same answer. And he won. He won. He, Jesus. <laughs> you can't see me out here, baby. You can't see me, you know what I'm saying? But apparently everybody has, because this is the first time he won. So it's the first time in the history of his show. That ain't necessary what you're doing. You don't have to reiterate that point. You want to reiterate something. He started reiterate it with the, the reiterate, <laughs> click, click. reiterate the fact that I won. You did win. And I'm, I'm, I'm glad you were able to beat me <laughs> for the first time. <laughs> Well, uh, I want to thank my special guest, to Wins, for coming on, thank having a great time with me. me. We had a good time. Uh, you want to tell a guest you got anything coming up real quick? Um, thank y'all so much for watching. We'll see you on the next episode of Word It Gets Hard. <laughs>